Deciding what buttercream to try can be confusing, so I've made a decision tree to help you. Now let's say you want to cook a portion of your buttercream. First, do you want egg yolks in your buttercream? And if you answered yes, do you like pastry cream? If you do, you want to give German buttercream a try. That one uses a custard or pudding base. If you want to avoid making a pastry cream, you can try French buttercream. And my version uses whole eggs cooked with sugar and then added to butter. Now let's back up a little and say you don't want to use any yolks at all. In that case, you can just use the whites, which lightens up the buttercream and yields a lighter texture. And for this, you have two similar options. There's Italian meringue buttercream, which is a little more challenging to make because you have to balance making sugar syrup while whipping up the egg whites. And then there's Swiss meringue buttercream where the sugar is directly cooked in the egg whites and then whipped up. Now let's say you don't want to use any whipped eggs at all. There's ermine or cooked flour frosting. That's where a flour paste is made and then added to butter. And then we have my category of buttercreams that are made using a sugar syrup, such as my no dye black buttercream. 